What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel for another love video. I forgot to film an intro for this video, so here we are the next day. Um, we blew the head gaskets in the love, and Kyler also um, lost the transmission in the Cummins, so we need to get the love running so that he can um, take the love as his daily since he can't take my car every day, unfortunately. The love needs a lot more work, and we would love to do a lot more to it, but unfortunately, we can't really do it right now since the Cummins is where it sits and we just can't really do it financially. So we're just gonna replace the head gaskets in it and leave it as it is and hopefully it runs. Um, so in this video, we're going to get everything taken apart that needs to be done, get the heads off so that we can replace the gaskets and stay tuned for the next video when we put everything back together and see if it runs. Thanks for watching, enjoy this video guys. Here's a little update. Got the carburetor off, got the intake manifold off, and got the valve covers off. Um, got everything up here disconnected. Got the distributor off. So I guess we're gonna keep going and just keep taking everything apart right now. So right now I'm just scribing lines into the intake ports. Gasket match if we end up deciding to port the heads out. I'm not positive if we're gonna do that yet or not, so I'd rather just be prepared if we do. Just a little bit, not much. It shows the heads aren't that much off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can kind of see it just a wee bit. Yep. Just a little. Just pulled the head off and this is the first thing we see. Wow. That is pretty gnarly. I don't know, I was just gonna hand it to you when you wanted to pry the next one off, but <laughs> I don't know what step you're at, so. I still got a minute. <laughs> just like, here you go. <laughs> Yeah, this is 
no impact. All right, so we're having issues when it comes to the dipstick being stuck on here because we weren't thinking about that, and the drill just broke. So we're gonna take we're gonna a break. take a break. We're gonna go start dinner, and we'll take it from there. I don't really know what gonna happen next to be honest. So we got the heads off the engine and I'm not too sure what the plans are yet. There's a lot of options. Either I can just, you know, get new gaskets, put it back together how it was, run it for a while, then do the stuff I want to do. I can put a different engine in it. That would be the best option to me, but the most expensive yeah. obviously. You might just do an LS swap. I don't know yet. <laughs> I, I'd love to, but Stay it's tuned expensive. and subscribe for future plans. <laughs> I could get the heads ported. I could deck them down a little bit to where it would raise the compression ratio just a little touch. I'm not too sure how much we could do though before the valves would risk hitting the pistons. Um, I'd love to do a cam swap. I mean, again, all this stuff is money though, so that's kind of at a standstill. The only thing I'm really capable of doing right now that I feel safe doing would just be putting it back together with new gaskets. But I'm, I hate doing that. That's just not what I believe in with performance vehicles. Uh, if you are got it apart, you might as well just do it. I don't know. What are you kind of thinking, though? I'm thinking... At this point, we mainly need to focus on the love, or I mean the diesel, but for the love, I'm thinking we'll probably just have to, like, port the heads or something. I don't know about deck numb or anything for more compression, just because I don't know what I can handle, but I'm thinking we'll probably just do that, and we'll probably just regasket it just so that we can get it running again. But next video, we'll probably be putting it back together. Probably just gaskets for the moment. Hopefully sometime in the future, we'll be able to do something like an LS. So I think we both really want to do that. But... The ultimate plans, though... I don't even think I've unveiled it to her yet what I'm thinking for a lot of this stuff. So <laughs> that's kind of keeping it interesting with her at least. So <laughs> if you want to see some crazy stuff... Yeah, just stay tuned. All right. Well, all right, we're gonna close. We're closing out tonight's vlog. Uh, thanks for watching um, another love video. I'm sure there'll be plenty more of them ahead since we obviously had to completely tear it apart tonight. But anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one. Bye.